What's going on, guys? This is Riggs from Clashing FFS, bringing you a very... It's actually probably going to end up being a very interesting video. Just a quick background. We're just going to put some attacks in the background. These will be attacks from the USA War versus CWL Japan here in the CWL Olympics. Look at that victory. A freaking eight-star victory. A huge shout-out to everybody over in CWL Japan. What I'm going to do... I'll just go ahead and pan down here to the very bottom and just show attacks. This video should not be too long, but there is something, shout out to Trinat, there is something I do want to say in response to a video that Team Russia uploaded onto YouTube. For those of you curious enough to go ahead, I'll go ahead and put the link to their video down in the description, please. I urge you to go check it out and let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. So basically, Team Russia is saying that USA, the, the, the clan that we are participating in here in the CW Olympics, they're basically calling us a bunch of cheaters and they're saying that we were sharing bases for America's All-Stars, which is interesting enough because America's All-Stars is... North America, I don't, I don't believe there's anybody from USA even in um, that clan. There's two other USA clans, but I'm getting sidetracked. So they're, they're saying that we cheated, that we were sharing bases, and that not only Team USA needs to be disqualified, but America's uh, America All Stars also needs to be disqualified because there there were four to five attacks that were pretty much an e a mere image of attacks that we did. We wore Team Russia first. Then America's All-Stars wore them. Now, they're saying that we shared bases and that we copied bases. The attacks looked exactly the same. So obviously, that must mean that we're cheating. It has nothing to do with a YouTube video that I uploaded. One of the attacks that, uh, or the, the, the one and only attack that they featured in their video uh, was an 11v11 three-star, even though they're saying that there are much more attacks than just that one. So my message to Team Russia is, it, first of all, if you're getting 11v11, if you're getting 10v10 three-star in any type of competitive war, the first thing you need to do is delete your base and you make a new one, right? If you get 10v10, it's kind of like a golden rule. You get 10v10, maybe you can tweak it possibly, but the, the golden rule is you get 10v10, you get 11v11 three-starred. That means you never run that base again and, and you, you, know, you start from scratch. You build a new base. Obviously, Team Rush didn't do that. We three-starred, uh, what do we have? Three 11v11 three-stars against them. And then they're going to go and run the exact same base as I upload a video showing all three of those bases and now they want us team usa disqualified listen the way let, let me tell you something the way this works team russia the way this works from what you're saying is basically youtube can't exist clash of clans uh shouldn't does not belong on youtube what do we show on youtube we show attacks that's what that's kind of it's kind of our thing you know you you, you show a badass attack you record it, you upload it onto YouTube. If you are either too lazy or you didn't build enough bases and you got to rerun the same base and the clan you just warred, like us, Team USA, and we make a recap and upload it onto YouTube, so be it. There's no rules because they're saying that we violated, uh, you know, had uh, multiple fair play violations. If someone watches a video on YouTube, and then they look in their war and then they see a clan running the exact same base. There is nothing written anywhere in the in the CWL rules saying that you cannot copy an attack. You can plan with other people. You know, when you're talking about fair play, there was no third party software used. No one's modding here. I'm not sure what you want. And and ironically enough, you guys are bitching, but yet you guys, I mean, you guys beat us by four stars. But I know it's not about, you know, the wins or losses. Uh, you know, I, I understand that, but what you're asking for is basically for no clans are allowed to watch a YouTube video 
of the clan they're warring and, and what until after until after the war's done. I mean, it just it just seems so silly what you guys are even asking for. I don't even know the results. I don't even know anybody over in America's All Stars. We warred them in round one. We beat them by a star. Then we warred who I don't even remember. Oh, then we warred Team Russia, lost. And then uh, this war right here, Japan. Stay tuned for the recap. But like I said, guys, I will have the video down in the description. Please check it out. I mean, we are all about fair play. And full disclosure, I mean, we're not trying to freaking hide anything here. Um, but, you know, if we're going to upload a video onto YouTube and someone watches it and then the clan that we ward is too lazy to change your bases and it gets and it gets three starred the exact same way that we did. And by the way, that's another thing. Um, that attack, if you're if you're Town Hall 11 and you have a freaking ring base, watch the recap and you run a freaking ring base, you're going, I'm sorry, you're going to get queen walk bitched. I mean, that's just, that's just how it goes. If you have no walls stopping a ginormous kill squad with 500 bowlers in it, uh, that's the attack that anyone's going to use. So, I mean, I guess, it's, I mean, don't run ring bases. That's lesson number one. Lesson number two from this is make sure you know what you're talking about before you're going to try to throw shade at you at Team USA, um, you know, trying to get us disqualified for something that we have n zero involvement in. Uh, lesson number three: If you get three starred, build a new base. So this is actually a learning thing. This is a learning thing um, for everybody, especially Team USA. So hopefully, you guys take some advice. You learn from your mistakes. You know, you get eleven v eleven. Don't run the same base, especially if you're warring a clan like Team USA and there's a YouTuber like me with thousands of subscribers that get, you know, we got thousands of people watching these videos. I mean, do you, how are you going to get upset at that? It, it, anyway, it makes absolutely no sense. Um, but yeah, anyway, feel free, check out the video. I will go ahead and have it down in the description. Uh, and it's really sad because I mean, I actually had fun warring team USA. I mean, uh, team Russia, it was, it was a lot of fun. No shade. We got, I mean, we took a four star loss had tons of fun warring them, even though, by the way, even though they, one guy left clan to go get bowlers and come back. They said he couldn't attack. Sorry, Richard. Uh, they said he couldn't attack. We abided by that. We did a spin that starts at 3 a.m. But uh, depending what time zone you're in, anywhere between 3 and 5 a.m. is when the war started for us. We gave Team Russia everything that they wanted. We swagged hits for them. We gave them the spin that they wanted and they're going to throw shade and talk about a freaking video that we had nothing to do with. Zero involvement. You, 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 you get three starred, build a new base. It's, I mean, it's the, it's, the, it's the best thing to do. Take away from this. There's nothing wrong with planning attacks with other people. It is not against, uh, you know, there's no fair play violation against uh, playing attack with someone else or watching a video, a recap video, and then copying the attack. There's nothing written anywhere saying that that is against, um, f uh, or that's a fair play violation within the CWL. If you're going to throw shade, you got to make sure you know what you are talking about. But that's going to do it. Shout out to everybody watching this video, supporting the channel. Check out, please do me a favor. Half of it is, and by the way, Team Russia, don't involve Jack Nicholson. If you guys watch their video, hopefully we can give them over a thousand views on that video. But yeah, do not involve Jack Nicholson, not only in Clash of Clans, but don't 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 get Jack Nicholson involved in the CW Olympics. It's not it's not fair to him. You should that was you should not have done that. At any rate. At any rate, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Please, comments, questions, or concerns down in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys in the very next video, uh, which will be the recap to the uh, Team USA versus CWL Japan. Hopefully you guys uh, enjoyed this one. But that is going to do it. And happy Easter weekend to everybody. As always, this is Riggs from Clashing FFS. And I'll see you in the very next video.